Orioles fans, teammates, and the rest of the baseball world honored the legendary Brooks Robinson today during a special memorial service at Oriole Park. The Hall of Fame third baseman died last week, and Paul Gessler reports from the stadium on how Mr. Oriole will be remembered. Right. And early, Orioles fans lined up to pay tribute. Sad day in Baltimore, that's for sure. Pay respects. It's lovely. It's a really special and beautiful thing. It's what I would expect from Baltimore and what I would expect from Orioles fans. Many here counted number five as one of them. Our whole family. He was part of our family. They honor him on their backs and in their hearts. We all, we all lost our childhood sports hero when Brooks died. I was concerned about what he did on and off the field. That to me is a complete man. Brooks Robinson. He's been as much a part of people's lives as the team itself. He's probably the all-time greatest third baseman who ever lived, but it's totally outdone by who he was as a human being. The what a year for him to leave here. I know we're going to win the World Series now. Okay, one for Brooks. Viva La Brooksy flies in the skies above the ballpark. We love Brooks Robinson. Inside, a ceremony at third base. Another eventual Orioles third baseman, Cal Ripken Jr., spoke about how Robinson was the Oriole to look up to. I will miss him. We will miss him. But he, lives with, he leaves us with so many great memories that will live on. The team draped black cloth over his retired number and leaves five hanging from the warehouse. He's changed so many lives for the better. With current Orioles paying respects in person, Brooks's son had one more ask of his dad. We love you. We will miss you. And if there's anything you can do up there to help bring another World Series championship <laughs> to Baltimore, this year, we will greatly appreciate it. Here at the statue of Robinson outside the ballpark, flowers continue to be left at his feet, and there are other tributes like these rocks. This one says, thanks, Brooks. Among the other speakers at Monday's memorial service include his grandchildren and former teammates Boog Powell, Doug DeSensei, and Eddie Murray. Reporting from outside Oriole Park in Camden Yards, I'm Paul Gessler for WJZ.